Hi, my name is Tracy, and today's video is sponsored by my very good friend, Jennifer Aniston, who wants to remind you to wear your sunscreen. Today's video is a try-on and review of the uh, Eliza Vecca Milky Piggy Sun Block Great Stick. Cute little packaging that expands from a pale piggy to a tan piggy. Very cute. Um, so this is the product. Uh, this one's a little bit old. Some of the writing's coming off. I actually just reordered this. Um, this is my second purchase and the one in the middle would be my third. Um, I love it so much. It's great to keep in the car, especially when you run out the front door and you forgot to apply your sunscreen in August. In the middle of the day, uh, in a hot car, this will not melt, it will not soften. I can't speak to um, Arizona heat, but I'm in North Carolina and it does get pretty hot. You will see a little bit of condensation and that's it. Another great feature of it is that it's not greasy at all. So I'll just go ahead and go like this. Wait. It, it's not slimy or tacky at all um which makes it great uh what i would do running out the door is at one red light i'd do what i need to do and at the next red light i'd rub it in and then i go back to steering with no residue on my um steering wheel so that's really fantastic it's lightweight um so a dermatologist that i follow on instagram um dr vanella hirsch um she recommended at one point that for stick sunblock you go over each area four times um, with I think she said a 20 or 25 percent overlap I'm going to try my best although it's not perfect because I don't have my glasses on so that you can see what it does to my makeup speaking of makeup slow it down um, I used my Patrick Star on till dawn which I'm a little bit obsessed with um, on the this side of my face. I just held it with a sheet of paper. So it should be pretty exact. Um, so let's go ahead. I'm wearing actually a ton of makeup because like my blush wasn't showing up. Two, three, four. Um, yeah, nothing was really showing up on camera. So, uh, I'll be able to tell if it just really messed everything up. Three, four. I mean, I'd be overlapping enough, but still, um, so I have mostly powder products on my face. I think that's four. And uh, so far, just looking, looks pretty good. Um, here I have a lot of um, hyperpigmentation. I think it's covered, you know, not perfectly, but decently. Let's see if that brings out any extra darkness. And then, um, get the forehead. My brows are done. Um, so let me just kind of see if I can blend it in such a way that it doesn't make everything bleed together. Like it here. So I do notice that it is um, always dewier after the fact, but it never makes me um, greasy or shiny, especially in the T-zone. Um, so that's, that's always a plus. Um, let's see. So, so far, to me, it looks pretty good. I don't know if there's a little bit of a glare there. All right, so... I do have the circles covered up. Let's see if those bring those out. Four. One, two, three, four. Um, it looks about the same. I'm just going to kind of tap it in. Now here comes the real test. I don't want to do this because I actually do want to go out tonight. But in the name of science, I will go over the wings with and without the setting spray. This is going to break my heart. One, two, three, four. Okay, so just 
<laughs> it erased it. Oh. Okay, so I guess that must have been my eyebrows traveling. Maybe. I'm not sure. So that's the side with the spray. And then... One, two, three, four. Okay, so... um. Maybe, maybe don't use it on your eye makeup because, you know, another great choice is going to be your sunglasses. You don't have to ruin your makeup if you forgot to put on your sunblock prior to applying it. Um, I think that answers all of the questions that I had. Um, I got mine on Amazon. Um... I don't remember the exact price, even though I just I literally just bought this, but I think that it's under under 15, under 20, something like that. And um, they last forever. Last summer, I did go through my stick, but it took several months of daily application. Um, and this is the second one, so I guess this would have been maybe end of summer fall and it still has this much left um if you have questions please let me know otherwise i hope you have a really fantastic day